Hey guys, look at the newborn baby. She is really happy with her new baby coat. Today I'll show you how to make this baby rocking coat at home and make your baby smile. Here are the wood that I use some for my this project. At first, I'm going to make this leg stand. I'm cutting the wood to perfect size for the leg stand. These two I using for bottom leg 2 inches by 2 and a half inches and another these two I using for top leg 1 inches by 2 inches. And now I am going to mark at the center and cut groove using hand saw. Hey, if you need my channel, wow, that's so great to have you here. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell icon so you're not going to miss any of my latest videos. and then make two holes for center joint. Here are I use one by one inches stick for the center. Here are I have cut a wood that I use for headboard and footboard. Now I am not going to cut any group or make any hole fit for the wood stick. 
I just make it simple way. Before I make it, I mark first. After that, I arrange. After arrange, I make a hole for the screw and screw it. That's simple. For the side panel, I using this stainless steel pipe that I take 18 inches long and border frame I using wood. Now mark, make holes fit for the pipes. Before I make holes, I mark first at the drill bit how deep I want the hole inside the wood. Now I take about half inch deep the hole inside the wood. So I easily can stop when I end up half inch. Here are I use two sides of this wood for the side panel. Two piece I using one inches by one and half inches for top and another two I using two inches by one inches for bottom.
now i use this one and a half inches drill bit that i am going to cut this wood like the wooden washer Here I use this 4 inches nut bolt with using this wood washer. After sanding, I use masking tape with newspaper fold for the pie and then I can easily spray color. Here I use trolley ruler for the leg. Next level.